what is up and welcome back to my channel if you are new here hello my name is Katie I live in Orlando and I do lots of like haul shop with me videos pretty much anything to do with like Target home goods shopping how I like to spend my money that sort of thing so if you love videos like that definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button down below today's video is so exciting if you can see from the title I am unboxing Target returns and you're probably like how well there's this website called we bargain they are like a liquidation website so they sell boxes like target clothing returns where you get like 20 pieces of clothing they have like specific categories like target home target kitchen decor returns tech returns they have amazon boxes they do also sell pallets as well and that's more money but it's really cool they have like so many different options and then you can also like you know like auction the price like say like i want to pay this much and then they'll give you back like Oh no, you're actually gonna pay this much. It's really cool. I have been waiting days for this box to get here and it is finally here, so I'm super excited to unbox it for you. I do wanna say that We Bargain did send me this box, but this video is not sponsored. I was gonna buy this box with my own money after I saw people on TikTok unboxing them. And then I went on their website and saw that they had this little like influencer program and so I just filled out the form and then they were like, yeah, we wanna send you a box. So they sent me the box, but the video is not sponsored. They're not like paying me to make this video. Actually, they didn't even really want me to make the video. They wanted me to just do something for Instagram, but I wanted to do this. The whole reason for me getting this box was to show it to you and unbox it in a YouTube video. So I just wanted to get that out of the way. Not sponsored, but they did send me the box. So thank you to them. I seriously cannot wait to dive into this box. So let me get a knife and let's start going over everything that's in the box. Okay, I changed the angle because I wanted you guys to like kind of also be able to see what is in it. Um, I'm so excited. Oh. I have no idea what's gonna be in this box. It is the Target like home and kitchen returns box. And some boxes have like an item that could be worth like $150 or something, I don't know. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. Okay, wait, before I touch that, the first thing I see on the top is this We Bargain February unboxing. Thank you for your business. If you have any questions, please call this number. And then it does say you can use code return20 for $20 off your next order. So if you are interested, Go use that code. What I'm laughing at is the first thing I see is this towel, and we actually have these towels. I'm gonna go get them. This is the towel that they sent me. These are the towels that we own. So that's actually really funny. Obviously, I'm gonna wash it first, but that's really cool that we got something that I know for sure we will keep um, because we already own these towels. Okay, so we're off to a good start so far. What is the next thing? Oh, I see something by KitchenAid. Oh, there's so many cool things in this box. Um, okay, I'm gonna grab this next thing. It's like a Christmas item. Ice and glass cube tray combo pack, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. Honestly, this could be a re-gift for sure, but it does come with little like ice cube trays. There's a bunch of packing peanuts in it, but this is the second item. Okay, the next, I will go for the KitchenAid because it looks like a big one. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is awesome! They sent me um, like a hand blender. We can actually use this to make foam for coffee, but it's also really good to make like soups or to like emulsify something. They have one for like guacamole. Oh my gosh, you guys, this actually has like really good stuff in it so far. I'm super pumped. So this is the next item. How much does this cost? Cause the box would have been like $120. I know the towel's like eight. So let's see, kitchen aid hand blender you know what's funny i can actually probably just scan it on my target barcode app thing let's see if that will work yes okay so it came up and it is originally fifty dollars for this kitchen aid hand mixer which is so cool it also looks like it comes with a little like cup to mix stuff in so this is awesome definitely keeping this and the towel so far the cups might be a re-gift or a donate. Okay, let's move on to the next item. I do see another big like threshold item, but what are these? So happy you're my husband, four cards. Too bad I just bought some cards. A lot of cards, a lot of Valentine's Day cards, three separate packs, so one to my wife and a four pack to my husband. Um, Brian and I are not married yet, but I could stash these away. I do have a card box that's like full of cards if you need to grab one. And then some more like little happy Valentine's Day cards. So I got three packs of those. Um, kind of looks like they just never got put out on the shelf. I don't think that they're a return. Okay, I'm gonna grab the next like big item I see, which is something by Threshold. I'll let you guys see it first. <gasps> Shut up. 
Oh, that's so funny. It's like their Christmas little like hand soap thing. I literally definitely showed this in a YouTube video. It's a clear little like crystal soap thing and then a little like soap tray. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. This is really cool so far. Like I actually, I think that you guys should do this. Like this is super fun. Okay, gonna grab the next thing. This is pretty cool. I've definitely seen this in the like Studio McGee department. This leather little like candle holder. This is wicked cute. This would be so fun for like flowers. Just a really cool vase. I don't see anything like particularly wrong with it. There are a couple dings in the glass, but I'm not mad at it. I'm so excited that this is in here. This is so fun, I love this. Let's scan this too and see like how much and then we'll add it all up at the end and see like if it was worth it. But I still have like a lot more stuff to go as well. I don't know if this will still show up. I'm pretty sure this did go to clearance um, like at Target, but online is always like a little bit different. So let's see if we can pull it up online okay yeah so it still comes up online as 20 bucks okay next item there's like a lot of like linen-y type stuff so let's like dig for that casa luna curtain is this like a casa luna shower curtain because casa luna is really really nice or it could be like a i don't know if it's like a shower curtain or it kind of looks like a shower curtain it's like a really pretty like red rusty type color and it has the little like place for the hooks it's linen this is cool, I really like this. Let's look this up on the Target app and see how much this would cost. Okay, so chambray shower curtain. So this is in the color clay and originally it is $30, which is so awesome. So that's like $100 right there already, not even counting the towel or the like mugs or whatever, so, or the cards. So we're doing pretty good here, I would say. Okay, I'm gonna reach for like the next linen-y type thing. This is, it's still, I don't know what that is. I think it's another shower curtain. <laughs> How many shower curtains does one person need? This one's really cute. It does have like a tassel detail at the bottom. It's striped and then it has um, like the little holes at the top. I don't know what brand this is. Most of the stuff has like a sticker on it somewhere. Maybe it was attached to this. Okay, yeah, so this is Hearth and Hand Striped Shower Curtain. So this is actually a Hearth and Hand item, which is awesome. I can look this up as well and let's see how much it is, but it has the little like tassels on the bottom. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I guess we're gonna need more showers. Okay, let's see how much the Hearth and Hand Shower Curtain is. Okay, so the Striped Hearth and Hand Shower Curtain, it is this one right here, and it is originally $24.99, so $25. I don't know, I like the color. I'm actually surprised. I would never buy like that color of the Casa Luna one, but it's actually really pretty. Like now that I have it here, I actually think it's really, really nice. It's just not a color I would originally go for, so it's pretty cool that I could get it in a box like this. I think we're getting down to the last few items. Okay, so this, <laughs> is covered in packing peanuts. Ah! Okay, so we got a drawer organizer, which is awesome. We have lots of drawers in our new apartment. Oh, is it broken? <gasps> it's broken! So that's my first item that is damaged, which that kind of stinks. But if it's just gonna go down in a drawer, honestly, like this part, we could just wood glue it, so I'm not like too mad about it. It doesn't like extend or anything, it's just the size that it is and it is threshold as well. Okay, let's go ahead and scan it and see how much it was like originally at Target. So, okay, so currently it is reduced to clearance on Target for $6, but it's regularly $10. Okay, we're getting down to the last few items. Next we have Dove Foaming Antibacterial Hand Soap and it is in the Soothing White Tea Scent. I'm not mad about it. It's always nice to have some extra hand soap down below. You never know when you're gonna run out. So this could easily go in like bathroom, guest bathroom. And they do sell at Target. I showed them in one of my recent Target Tuesday videos. Foaming hand soap dispensers at Target, like cute threshold ones. So it's really cool because if you're like a foaming hand soap type of person, normally it would be really hard to find like a soap dispenser that does that kind of soap. But now they have them at Target. So I might pick one up for this soap. That way we can make sure we get use out of it. And it's good that it's antibacterial because you know why. Okay, this is the last item. This is the only one that I'm like It is an LED light, but it's like a flame. It's oh, the fire emoji. Uh, I don't know. Brian might want to keep this. I don't I don't really know. I don't really see us uh, holding on to this, but I think it'd be really cute for like a little boys room or something. I do want to scan it and see if it is like a target item. 
So it is $15 mini LED fire novelty table lamp orange and it's from the brand West and Arrow. Oh, they have a couple other ones that are really cute. They have like a rainbow one. They have this one that says dream that's really, really cute. But yeah, so this is originally $15. I wanna go ahead and add up everything and then tell you what the total was and we will see if we think it's a good deal. Okay, so I'm gonna add up everything like live. So I think like what's gonna bring up my total a lot is actually these cards because cards are really expensive these days. So there's four in here and these are $8.99 a piece. Let me get out my handy dandy calculator. Okay, so $8.99 times four equals $35.96. And then we have four more. These ones are six. 99 times four equals 27.96. So, so we're already at $64. Then there's a lot of cards right here. There are two packs. So there's eight Valentine's Day cards, but there are two packs and they're $6.99 each. So plus $6.99 plus $6.99. Oh God, I just messed up the total. I just messed up the total. Wait, 64 plus seven plus seven. So we're at $70. This was 15, so plus 15. Then this shower curtain was originally 25. And then this shower curtain was 30. Okay, so we're doing really good, we're already at $140. Then this glass vase is 20, so plus $20, we're at $168. This was originally 10, so we're gonna add 10. The KitchenAid emulsifier, this is definitely the best thing I feel like I got in here. I'm definitely really excited about this. And this was $50, so plus 50. Now I'm gonna wait till the end to tell you the full total. Okay, this was originally $8. So the towel is originally $8, so plus eight. The soap set is originally $15, so plus 15. And then this like glass and ice cube thing is also 15, so plus 15 brings our box total to $266 of stuff. And the boxes online are like $120. I feel like it's pretty good. I'm honestly really happy with a lot of the stuff I got in my box. And I don't want you to think that like just because they sent me the box that they put better stuff in it. It's definitely not like that. Like I said, they honestly like didn't even really want me to make the video. I was like, hey, I was going to make a YouTube video. And they were like, mm, we don't care. So... I don't think that they put special items in the box and like I said I was gonna buy one of these anyways with my own money Definitely let me know down below if you guys would be interested in me doing like another one of these videos because this was seriously So fun for me to do they have like clothing ones like I said they have like Amazon returns They have so many like different types Let me go on their website and like read off to you like some of the ones that they have and then you could tell me If you think I should do it again and like what one you would want me to unbox Okay, so their boxes like kind of change pretty frequently but right now they have like premium Amazon returns wholesale box premium target returns wholesale box Those are like general like you could get stuff from any category Right now a lot of them are sold out but keep checking because they come back into stock all the time Then they have premium we bargain electronics wholesale box so all different electronics that one is 175 and supposedly that one is worth $750 so that's really cool so so they have a ton of different boxes to choose from. I would love to do this again. So definitely let me know if that is something that you would be interested in. Alrighty, you guys. Well, that is going to be it for me today. I really hope that you love watching this fun little video of me unboxing Target Returns. Like I said, I was super excited to get this box and see what was in it. I didn't look in it like this was my real reactions and I was dying to open this box. So thank you so much for watching. If you love this video, definitely make sure you let me know down in the comments below and definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you next time. Bye guys!